So you've got this all planned out. Are you visualizing? Can you see it happening? Yes, yes, I can. Is he cute or what? Wow. A local boy's vision to help find a cure for a devastating disease comes from a personal loss. And now this 10 year old is sharing his story in hopes it will inspire you. News tonight how Ryan is making a difference in the fight against Alzheimer's. Hi, Ryan here. Mom and I are raising money for ALZ research. ALZ, as in Alzheimer's disease. This is Ryan's great grandfather, Richard Golden, from Clarksburg. As you can see, the two were close. So after Mr. Golden died last year as a result of the brutal disease at the age of 81, Ryan, with the help of his family, made it his mission to raise research funds and support money for caregivers dealing with Alzheimer's. And he's doing it in a way, well, that's perfect for a 10 year old boy. Ryan posted this video on Facebook. If we raise $100, I'd be a cracking egg on my mom's head. 200 and he'll throw in some flour. 300 gets mom a peanut butter and jelly face mask. So you've got this all planned out. Are you visualizing? Can you see it happening? Yes, yes I can. And it is going to happen because we've raised so far $1,104. Money helping to reach a larger goal ahead of this weekend's walk to end Alzheimer's. This is where we really watch those numbers climb. So our fundraising goal is $476,000 this year. Um, we're over $300,000 towards that goal. Ryan's mom, Ashley, points out getting children involved in this type of fundraising can help ease the pain of seeing a loved one change before our eyes. It took a lot of that fear out, and they were able to go visit him in a place that was unfamiliar to him and still spend time with him, even though he didn't act like who he was before. But to Ryan, he was still great grandpa, and his memory, although stolen from him, lives on through loved ones. The walk to end Alzheimer's is this Saturday at the state capitol. I'll be proud to MC the event, so stop by and say hi. To donate or join in, go to their website. We've set up a link on ours, cbs13.com.